Says excessive heat is especially difficult on animals. Just imagine walking around outside in a fur coat. So dangerous, in fact, the Arizona Humane Society has been flooded with calls for welfare checks. Ashley Berry rode along as emergency animal medical technicians were busy saving lives. This right here is the perfect example of animal neglect. Humane Society officials say this chihuahua clearly in heat distress. When we pulled up, he had no water. Not only that, but just beyond that fence there, there were two other dogs with absolutely no shade. Small buckets, big buckets, bowls. It was only 10 a.m. and already 30 calls into the Humane Society. So far, all of these are no waters. Emergency animal medical technician Lori Cooper had a busy day ahead. Unfortunately, the calls start coming in as soon as we open. It started with a complaint of a dog chained to a fence with no water in the North Valley. Do you have a dog here? Okay. Uh, can we make sure he's okay? We got a call that he was all tangled up and couldn't get to his water. Fortunately, this family was in compliance with Arizona law. The male mixed breed named Bagger had adequate shelter, a water dish inside his house, and plenty of shade for the entire day. Everything was done within a safe manner and within the law. And the dog was in perfectly good health, too. He looked great. Next up, a condo in the East Valley, a complaint of an animal outside on the back porch. No sign of a dog and the residents were not home. Cooper left contact information and moved on to downtown Phoenix. This situation was not good. Oh, he's out here with no water. The relative immediately brought the dog water after Cooper provided him with a bucket. The dog drank it and dipped his paws in to cool off. Then, evidence of more animals in the back. Cooper said it was in the owner's best interest to leave work. When he came home, he let her in the back. Our audio was recording. Listen to this okay. incessant panting. And so I get a chance to build something. Okay. And you have to do something today. I can't leave with them like this. All three were in heat stress. All three were taken care of thanks to the Arizona Humane Society and the vigilance of neighbors. Ashley Berry, 3TV. And signs of heat stress in animals include that excessive panting that you just heard there or dark or bright red tongue, gums and underside as well as high pitched barking. The Humane Society says anyone who doesn't comply with the law could be charged with animal cruelty, face fines and possibly 